It's like 8 in the Rock morning right now. Is it called the Rockefeller Center? Yeah, yeah I, I don't know why I have never gotten there with Alex before. By the way, this is our first time in New York City with Alexa. And I was so excited to see if Alexa is going to love New York City as much as we do. Alexa, do you love New York City? Uh. Oh, that just like makes me so happy. We got to catch a cab and get there early before all the tourists get there. And I think that's one of the reasons I haven't gone there yet is because, you know, if you don't get there early, then it's just like way too many people. We'll see what happens. Already a little late. I think we might be a little late already. So how do you catch a cab? Like this. Like this. <laughs> She's a New Yorker already. There's already a little lineup. We're definitely not early um, because by the time we got here, it's like 8:30, and there's like quite a lot of people here. So the views here are so high. Crazy high. So the verdict is, I'm still so happy we came early. Yeah, it's really great. It's, yeah. It's like it's starting like it's still more and more people. It, there's st even though there's still a lot of people, it's quite big areas, so they're all scattered kind of far apart, and you can't take a picture without a tourist in your photo. So, absolutely beautiful views. Really, really, you do feel like you're on top of the world, or yeah. on top of the rock. Yeah. Alex is not too impressed, to be honest. Alex, she loved the elevator, and the moment we got here, she wants to take the elevator again. And I'm like, can I please take some pictures? You want to take the elevator? Was We're that the best part? What about the view? The view is so nice though. <laughs> yeah, she's not impressed, she's not impressed with, the view, with the view. But I'm definitely impressed with the view. It's so gorgeous. Yeah. Like, wow. You? Um, yeah, I love it. It's awesome. You, you would recommend to come here? It's, it's pricey. Uh, yeah, it is pretty pricey. I, I guess we're not used to it because we're from London and we don't pay for any museums or anything. So we're just kind of very grateful for that. So yeah, but I think it's worth it. It's you know, like once in, a lifetime, yeah, once in a lifetime, maybe twice, you know. Yeah. I'd come back on a sunset, that's for sure. That's true. Must be a lot of people yeah. here at sunset. It's worth it for a beautiful pink sunset. Yeah. But I can imagine the lineups here. When you guys are here, make sure you get to the very, very top. You have to take another flight of stairs because here it's not really guarded so you can actually take a picture without the glass and the view is just sensational. Amazing. Alexa, do you like the view? Yeah, <laughs> very quiet, yeah. It was raining all week. Yeah. And 
he's supposed to bring it, but like we're almost at the end of our trip. We managed without a stroller yeah. because Alex actually walks a lot. And then when she doesn't feel like walking, I carry her or Alex carries her. We're having breakfast today at one hotel, which as you guys know is one of our favorite hotels. By Central Park, and my parents are coming here now in an Uber. Welcome. Welcome to New York City. My dad's first time in New York City. Well, also my mom's first time, but she's been here for a few days. I like to get the phone somehow. Yeah, she somehow grabbed my phone and the. And she's process. really happy. What are you gonna do? Well, she just wants to take pictures. Whenever she gets the phone, she just wants to take photos. Well, you don't let, there's no other apps. You can't yeah, my phone is blocked anyway, so she can't use it. I need to look at that room for you. Surprise! Ha! Ha! Oh! Bullshit! 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 Well, let's make some tea. <laughs> Alex and Annie. Alex, come. Alex is always excited to go to the playground. Yeah. Favorite place. Feels like they come and go, you know I'm here to stay. Lifetime to live, but I just want to push away. Alexa is having the time of her life. There's so many amazing playgrounds in New York City. I just love it. And most of them have like a water splashing area. So she's just crazy about that. She can literally spend hours just playing with the water. She's right there with Alex. And also there's a sand pit and there's like so many cool areas in this playground. It's amazing. But you can feel the hustle and the bustle. Ah. So where's the salon, do you know? Yeah, come. This way? Alex actually helped me book it. Oh, yeah. find the salon. Yeah, find it, yeah. You're the best. So you gotta wake up. But like, I don't want to get my hair ruined. I spent all that money and time. Was it was it a good blow dry? Yeah, I really enjoyed it. Okay, it's good that you enjoyed it. So this is real love. Giving a shirt to a girl, to your girl who had just had her hair done. Exactly. 
and I had a super long lunch and I was just telling Mimi, it was like, New York is just crazy, it's so dense, every time we're here, just meet so many like random awesome people. Randomly, yeah, I'm just, I love I'm just sitting at a like restaurant, sitting next to some actor. I didn't even know because I'm like, I'm not even into pop culture. And it's out there, you know, a really great uh, business person. Yeah, so all. So you made some friends? Yeah, it was great. Highland this morning, which is one of our favorite places here in New York City because it is such a great story where they turn railroad tracks into this beautiful long park and the views around are so great because you get to see the really beautiful parts of New York City now that used to be grungy before and then on the other side of New York City you see the, the water so basically on one side you have the water on one side you have really nice beautiful buildings and then also probably seen this part you know, have just featured the movies a lot this stairs with a glass window that looks on the street so great to just come here and go for like a really nice long walk there's food and ice cream and all kinds of stuff little splash pads for kids Alexa spent like an hour if not more last time we were here just like splashing in the water so yeah it's really really great place to check out This is where she spent over an hour last time just splashing in the water, running around. So usually this place is actually packed because it's really early right now, probably, I don't know, is it 9 yet? What time is 9 it? 9.30. Yeah, it's 9.30 in the morning, so there's not a lot of people here. But usually you come in the afternoon, there's people like tanning on all these benches. And these are so awesome. It's like a little oasis in the heart of the city. That's the best way to describe this place. Somebody's having fun. I got my shoes off too. A chance to do that yet. Yeah, my parents offered to take Alexa to playground, so that's where they're gonna go now. And Alex convinced me to take a bike in New York City. I've never ever biked in New York City. I'm a little freaked out because of all the traffic, but you convinced me to do it. It should be fine. There's hopefully, bike lanes. Yeah, hopefully yes. there's bike lanes that are safe because clearly we don't have a helmet. So yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. Go. Taking a nap? 
mattress. <laughs> it's a cool concept to it. You can even nap, I think, in there. Where? <laughs> Oh my god, it's so cool inside. It's like mm. old dark. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Concept store number one. Did you take a nap? What? Did you take a nap? Uh, for like a minute. Yeah. It's so loud. It's Broadway. I can't even hear what you say. Yeah. I'm like, what? 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 Oh, no. Oh, no. Best reaction. She was so cute. This is the real part of New York. When we're now with Alexa, we're shopping for Alexa. It's a new brand called Old Birds. Everything is made out of wool, so they're like super soft and comfortable. Are you gonna get the matching one? Yeah. Get into Everlane. It's crazy. It's crazy. Good for them. But in case you guys don't know about Everlane, they also started online. How many years did they do it online? They only recently started like open the retail space probably last year. And as you can see, they're very successful. That's crazy. So like this is like the Era of concept store. Yeah, this is basically where you open up the store. Hi. Hi. Hi, So sweet. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. Can I have some? We're uh, uh, still waiting. How many? I just met this beautiful girl, Maria, right? Yeah. It's yeah. It's a pleasure to meet She's you. She's amazing. I love her. You're amazing too. Somebody on the street that you know you follow virtually, but you don't know. You never know. I feel how like I know you. Person. I feel like I know Mimi. Oh. <laughs> I know you don't know me, but I feel like I know you. <laughs> Thank you. has shared her babysitter, who is watching Alexa now. She's already sleeping, obviously. She sleeps like seven to seven, or well, not seven to seven. Like seven to six, that would be nice though. So usually she never wakes up, so our babysitters have the best job ever. And uh, yeah, my parents are here. The four of us can actually go out, which like almost never happens. Yay, last day, finally. So what's your impression of New York City? I know you spent a week yeah, here with I us. I said already. And my dad literally just my spent life. two days. Yesterday and today. I'm getting there. I like it. You like New York City? More and more. More and more. See, that's what happened to me. My first time in New York City was winter, so like I didn't like it at all. Second time was springtime. I was like, okay, I could like this city. And then the more I came, the more I fell in love with it. And like, it's definitely one of my favorite cities in the world. Mom, you, you had a whole week here. Very nice. Few People days. are kind, very friendly, open mind. And you can see every nationality which I like because my back home own city is multicultural. That's what I miss it. And Toronto is multicultural. It's very important for me to have everybody is in the planet all together. Yeah. That's definitely one of the things about New York City. You see so many interracial couples, interracial kids. And it's just like, I love to see that. I don't know, it just makes me really happy. It's just the variety of everything. People, food, buildings, just everything. Everything that you see around yourself. There's so much variety in such a small space that makes the city very, very exciting. So if you guys watched our Miami vlog, we went to Upland there and the food was just amazing. So we're really excited to try this Upland. No expectation. We'll see. The core looks the same. Oh yeah, you're right. Oh, got a 
that shit. Bought through it. Is it hot? Yeah, it's hot.